Since the 1990s, many Chinese companies have been notoriously known for IP theft and counterfeiting. Hackers contracted by the Chinese government have already stolen trillions worth of cutting-edge technology blueprints from many multinational corporations. And after one major Chinese tech company recently announced a new but familiar-looking humanoid robot, many people believe that China may have blatantly copied Elon Musk and the Tesla bot. On the eve of its autumn launch event in Beijing, Xiaomi unveiled its first full-size humanoid bionic robot. Xiaomi Cyber One is the company's second robotic product, following the announcement of the Xiaomi CyberDog at their 2021 autumn launch event. The Xiaomi Cyber One, like most other humanoid robots, is still a work in progress. According to Xiaomi, future versions of the robot will not only have high emotional intelligence, but will also be able to perceive human emotions. Despite the fact that the first-generation Cyber One does displayed on stage appeared to have difficulty walking, efforts are being made to improve its ability to master the art of bipedal movement. Xiaomi CEO Lei Jun was presented with a rose on stage by Cyber One at the company's flashy launch event in Beijing. Cyber One's AI and mechanical capabilities are all self-developed by Xiaomi Robotics Lab, Lei Jun explained. We have invested heavily in R&D spanning various areas, including software, hardware, and algorithms innovation. The Cyber One humanoid robot is powered by a combination of advanced advanced mechatronics, and AI developed by Xiaomi Robot Labs, the company's dedicated robotics division. Despite the fact that the Cyber One is a first-generation product, the manufacturer claims to have spent significant resources and manpower developing it. At the moment, the production of such a model costs just under $90,000. However, Xiaomi hopes to reduce this cost and plans to market its robot to the general public. While developing any bionic robot is difficult, developing a humanoid robot becomes exponentially more difficult. Needless to say, the Cyber One project was a significant step forward for Xiaomi, even in comparison to the already complex Cyber Dog. The Cyber One is also one of the largest humanoid robots out there, measuring 5 feet 9 inches and weighing slightly more than 115 pounds. It has a 168 centimeter arm span. It's roughly the size of a typical human. The robot can also answer questions in real time and carry small objects weighing up to 1.5 kilograms or 3.3 pounds with one hand. To keep the robot's weight under control, Xiaomi engineers had to adhere to strict weight limits. Due to these constraints, they were eventually able to reduce the weight of the motor that powers the limbs to 500 grams. The main motor, which is positioned around the hip joint, is said to have a peak torque of more than 300 newton meters. At the launch event, Xiaomi also spoke about its proprietary MiSense depth vision module, which is used on the Cyber One. These technologies, combined with Xiaomi's proprietary algorithms, appear to provide Cyber One with the capability to perceive space in three dimensions. The robot can also recognize specific individuals, gestures, and facial expressions thanks to this algorithm. According to Xiaomi, Cyber One can simulate human movements with up to 21 degrees of freedom in motion and a real-time response speed of 0.5 milliseconds for each degree of freedom. Because of the built-in Mi AI Environmental Semantic Recognition Engine and Mi AI Speech Emotion Recognition Engine, the Xiaomi Cyber One in its current form can distinguish between 85 different types of environmental sounds. When verbal communication is inadequate, the curved OLED display on the head can be employed to show real-time interactive content and related information. Xiaomi has made it abundantly clear that the Xiaomi Cyber One's first generation is merely the company's first step towards creating advanced humanoid robotics. The Xiaomi Cyber One in its current form can identify between 85 different types of environmental sounds thanks to the built-in Mi AI Environmental Semantic Recognition Engine and Mi AI Voice Emotion Recognition Engine. When verbal communication fails, the curved OLED display on the head can be used to display real time interactive features and related information. The promised real-world applications of Cyber One range from manufacturing support to human companionship. Xiaomi has made it clear that the first iteration of the Xiaomi Cyber One is simply the company's first step toward developing advanced humanoid robots. On the other side of the pond, Tesla's second AI day has been moved from August 19th to September 30th, according to Elon. Tesla's flexible timelines are nothing new, but the reasons for this one in particular are fascinating. Elon blamed the delay on the possibility of having a working humanoid robot to show off by that point. Elon discussed what to expect from the upcoming Tesla Optimus, also known as the Tesla Bot. The Tesla CEO wrote a column in the official publication of China's Cyberspace Administration about the robot, which he claims will have its first prototype this year. The Tesla Optimus was first revealed as a concept in 2021, and Elon appears to be focused on the project. Today's cars are increasingly like smart, web-connected robots on wheels. In fact, in addition to cars, humanoid robots are also becoming a reality, with Tesla launching a general-purpose humanoid robot in 2021.
2021, Elon wrote in the column. The Tesla CEO then pointed out some design highlights. Elon claims that the Tesla bot will be close to the height and weight of an adult, allowing it to carry or pick up heavy objects. It will also be capable of walking quickly in small steps. The bot has two arms, two hands with five fingers, and two legs, just like a human. It'll be five feet, eight inches tall, and weigh 125 pounds. The Tesla Optimus can carry 45 pounds over long distances and deadlift 150 pounds, making it potentially very useful for assisting with picking up items. It can only move at five miles per hour, which Elon claims is fast enough for most people to escape if something goes wrong. If you can run faster than that, you'll be fine, Elon joked. Elon mentioned that the Tesla Optimus would have a screen on its head and eight cameras, similar to Tesla cars that can drive with autopilot assistance. It's all the same tools we see in the car, he explained. Elon also explained Tesla's reasoning behind the Tesla bot's design. You may wonder why we designed this robot with legs. Because human society is based on the interaction of a bipedal humanoid with two arms and ten fingers. So if we want a robot to adapt to its environment and be able to do what humans do, it has to be roughly the same size, shape, and capabilities as a human, he wrote. According to Elon, the Tesla bot's entire concept is to replace people in repetitive, boring, and dangerous tasks. He gave examples from the factory, such as retrieving a bolt and attaching it to a car, and from everyday life, such as going to the store and getting groceries. The vision is for them to serve millions of households, such as cooking, mowing lawns, and caring for the elderly, the Tesla CEO wrote. Achieving this goal requires that robots evolve to be smart enough and for us to have the ability to mass-produce robots. The highly anticipated prototype will enable Tesla to address the issue of large-scale production. Thereafter, humanoid robots' usefulness will increase yearly as production scales up and costs fall. In the future, a home robot may be cheaper than a car. Perhaps in less than a decade, people will be able to buy a robot for their parents as a birthday gift, Musk wrote. It's foreseeable that with the power of robots, we'll create an era of extreme abundance of goods and services, where everyone can live a life of abundance. Perhaps the only scarcity that will exist in the future is for us to create ourselves as humans. When he first announced the Tesla bot at Tesla's inaugural AI day, Elon said that the human robot had the potential to be more significant than the vehicle business over time. That said, it's possible that in the future, physical work will be a choice. So far, the main difference between Tesla and Xiaomi's bots is that Cyber One exists and Optimus does not, at least not yet. It's worth noting that Xiaomi's humanoid looks pretty wobbly when it walks. But as we pointed out earlier, Cyber One is able to perceive 3D space as well as recognize people, gestures, and expressions, enabling it not only to see but also to process its environment too. Cyber One can detect happiness and even comfort the user when they're sad. But despite their stark similarities on paper, it's still unclear whether Xiaomi's Cyber One is a Tesla Optimus copycat or not. The world of humanoid robots is advancing faster than anybody anticipated. And besides Tesla and Xiaomi, a couple of other major players have also made significant strides. Toyota, the world's largest automaker, has also been dabbling in robotics for quite some time now. Toyota announced its return to developing new humanoid robots in 2017 with the THR3. Toyota's robot division had shifted its focus away from humanoid robots and toward other robotic ventures at the time. Its HSR, or Human Support Robot, was a mobile manipulator platform with a user-friendly design. These helpful and friendly robots were created to help with household chores and simple tasks. But despite being classified as humanoid, they did not resemble humans. The Japanese automaker returned to the humanoid game with the THR3, revealing tons of new technological advances since its debut. These include improved mobility, precise positioning, and wireless operation in a test run. Furthermore, it can prepare drinks like a bartender, the THR3 is intended for both domestic and industrial use. It can be controlled via a designated base equipped with wearable controls for the system's master arms and master foot. It also has a head-mounted display that allows operators to see the world through the eyes of the robot. As a result, the user can operate the robot safely regardless of where it is. Since Tesla's Optimus hasn't made its debut yet, it's safe to say that Toyota's THR3 is undoubtedly Xiaomi's most fierce competitor. It's unclear what Xiaomi intends to do with Cyber One. The company stated in a press release that robotics is the crown jewel of manufacturing and went on to explain how difficult it was to combine all of this technology into a single unit, implying that the Cyber One, like so many robotics projects today, is primarily a technological showcase. However, just like Tesla, the company stated that the technology used in Cyber One will be used in other Xiaomi products in the future. You can support us by liking this video and subscribing to our channel if you haven't already. We really appreciate it. Well, that's it for now. Thanks so much for watching and until next time, welcome to the future.